Good morning, mother footless. Hope you guys are all having a great day. So today I am going to drive to a soccer park that's like down the street from me. I'm gonna go do some miles. But usually I work out before I eat, but I was so hungry. So I made, um, oh my gosh, I have to show you guys this. So it's cauliflower rice and I believe it's called medley, something like that. But it has little green beans or green peas in it and little um, carrot slices. And I cooked five egg whites with it. And for the whole bag of cauliflower, it's nine grams of carbs. Um, and then I also cut up these Aloha, they're, they're from Gilbert Sausages and they're made of chicken, but they're called Aloha because they're like sweet um, sausages. Bombed out motherfucking calm. I'm actually gonna show you guys really quick in case if anyone encounters this. I'm pretty sure everyone goes to Walmart unless you live in a completely different place. But I get Green Giant because literally the only ingredient in here is cauliflower or the veggies. Um, where I used to get Bird's Eye, which is this brand. And I still like Bird's Eye. I get a lot of other stuff from Bird's Eye. But I just don't get cauliflower because it has like sugar and stuff like that in it. And uh, if I could simplify the ingredients as much as I can, why not, right? And this is the brand of sausages that I got. These are the Capri flavors though bomb.com it, it has like mozzarella cheese and like tomato oh yeah basil mozzarella uh and sun-dried tomatoes um the aloha ones it's like a lighter green it literally says aloha but i threw away the box this is the last aloha sausage i have the point is gilbert sausages bomb.com and then yeah the five egg whites and i'm drinking this with the it's my last one. So everything together with the shake included, it's 441 calories, 51 grams of protein all together. Getting them good. Oh my God, my armpits are so freaking <laughs> prickly right now. <clears throat> but yeah, I am so excited to freaking move to Virginia, guys. I'm working on selling this house. I cannot wait for it to get sold. I'm really, really hoping that sooner than later mm, it's been on the market for like nine days now mm, i have a meeting on the 11th and there's gonna be a whole bunch of agents there and agents go up to the podium and they announce their listings and whoever's interested could get with them after the meeting so i'm gonna go to that um which is on the 11th i think it's thursday wednesday or thursday um so i'm really Fingers crossed, praying to God, someone's interested. Um, I'm praying that multiple people are interested, but we'll see. The, the market's shifting to a buyer's market right now, which kind of sucks because it was a seller's market for a while. It's still a seller's market, but we missed like the top of the market. Um, so just fingers freaking crossed because the sooner I get it sold, the sooner I can move to Virginia. I have a wedding to go to on the 24th of September anyways that I really want to go to. So I still have that, but I, I want to leave by the end of September. Um, but I also really want my money. So yeah. Anyways, when I'm out there, I already know what gym I'm going to go to. So for those that don't know, which is everyone who's watching this, I go to the Lion's Den. It's a training center. And there they have boxing in the morning, which I always do. And then um, they have upper body lifting, lower body lifting, and then full body um, but when I'm out in Virginia, I'm going to join this gym called One Life, which is the gym my best friend used to go to that I loved. Um, really, really nice. It's like two stories. It's huge. It's an open gym. So I go in there, do my own workouts, which I'm ready for because I actually know like the amount of reps to do, what to do, how to do it, yada, yada. And then they also have classes, which I fucking love. They have Zumba. They have kickboxing. But I guess in kickboxing, they don't use like the equipment. It's more like the motion, but I'm so down to do it. It's a class. Oh, yeah, but they have Zumba, they have that, and then Lauren that said something else. I forgot, but I'm so fucking excited for Zumba because your bitch can fuck shit up, and I'm just excited. I used to really love Zumba when I was younger, um, and I'm also really excited because I have friends out there that like to work out, so I'm going to have gym partners, and usually I like working out alone, but I don't mind with these people. I actually like to work out with them. Mm. So, yeah. That's what's going on right now. I had an open house yesterday. It was a flop. I mean, I can't think that way. A total of three separate people showed up. So that's good. Better than no one. But still, like, 
I wanted the door to be lined up, even though I knew that wasn't gonna happen. Open houses are usually pretty lonely, unless if it's like a freaking million dollar listing and you're out somewhere like super bougie, I don't know. But still, I just, I want there to be more people for the house. It'll come though, I just have to be patient. You know, I'm doing what I can every day. Ooh, I don't know how my shoulder looks to get it sold, but I just want it to happen already, you know? But I gotta tell myself it's only been nine days, as long as I'm consistent, keep doing what I'm doing. And yeah. Um, mm. I'm trying to think what else I was gonna say. I hear my mom waking up. But anyways, um, yeah, I'm just really fucking excited to go out there because I have friends. So I could push myself when it comes to working out like I have been. But lately, I've been stagnant. I'm like one, I've been going from like 165 to 169. My lowest weight ever was 147. And I, I do miss that number. <clears throat> but I had no muscle. I lost all my weight for cardio. But then I took a trip to Vegas and then Virginia, or Virginia, then Vegas. And I gained weight there. And then I was also, that was also the same time as Christmas and Thanksgiving. So like within those months, yoga heart was eaten. And like going from like eating pies and, you know, going out drinking, like it was hard for me to fully get back on track. Um, so I'm a lot better now, but I just haven't gone back down to 147. Um, and I'm okay with where I'm at right now. But I just know I didn't come this far in my weight loss journey to just be here, you know? Um, like, I back in high school, the biggest I ever was was 240 pounds. But my average, I was, like, 240 for, like, I want to say for, like, a good year. I've always been up and down in my weight. Like, always. Uh, but I've always been chubby. Uh, but, yeah, I used to be 240. But I think, like, like I said, the average biggest I've been was about 215 to 220 um, cause when I lived in Virginia, that was about my average weight for a good chunk of the time I was there. And then 2019, I was like, Alicia, bitch, you need to make a difference to your motherfucking life right motherfucking now. And I did. So yeah, 166, 169, still good. I'm still happy, but your girl's trying to get thinner and fuller. And I already know I'm getting stronger. So like, I'm definitely, I've gotten a lot stronger. Uh, but anyways. I have friends out there who love to work out. Like Lauren, me and her were on it when we were together. Liam, I'm so excited to work out with Liam. And yeah, I have a friend, Sam, that lives out there and he lives in Newport News. And when I'm out there, I'm gonna see if he wants to work out because he lives in Newport News too. And Lauren and him actually will be living the closest to me. Liam, him and I would take turns, like he would probably come to my gym. And he has a black card at Planet Fitness. So if I don't feel like going to my gym or if I feel like working out with him, then I could just go over there with him. So I'm excited. But yeah, those three are the people I'm probably going to work out with, especially Lauren and um, Liam. But I'm just so fucking excited because I know I'm about to transform for sure out there. Like my whole weight loss journey started when I was out there. And when I was out here, I continued it, but then it turned more into muscle building. But... When I'm out there, I'm just naturally so active. Like I'm always like just out doing stuff. And like Liam wants to go rock climbing and we do stuff like kayaking and you're just, I'm just outdoors more. Where in the A V I kinda have to like make myself like go for a walk outside. And I haven't been doing that too lately. I have a treadmill in here, but I get bored as fuck looking at the wall. You know, I need a destination to get to. Like the other day I walked all the way to Walmart and back and then before that, I walked all the way to the park and back. You know what I mean? So. Yeah. Oh, and my Aunt Megan, she really wants to work out with me too. So it's just nice knowing I have people out there that are like, I know, not counting on me, but they're like, oh my God, Alicia, when you're here, we're working out together. And I'm like, yes, bitch. And I'm comfortable to work out with them. Like, if it's a fucking stranger, I don't like working out with strangers. I've worked out with a stranger before and then he tried hitting on me. And I was like, this is why I don't like working out with fucking guys. Like, especially guys I don't know. Like, at least Liam and Sam, I fucking know them. I don't care. They see me look gross and I could sweat in front of them. But 
Oh, I'll never forget that dude. He was my coworker and he just made shit so fucking uncomfortable and ew. He looked like a chihuahua. But anyways, I had nothing to do with it, but I had to throw that out there. Um but what's it called? What's it called? What's it called? Yeah. Uh, and that's like another cool thing why uh, about starting this channel. Because it's just me talking. Like I am not counting on getting subscribers. I'm not doing this to I'm not doing this to grow an audience. I'm really just doing this just to talk. I like talking. My mom's a fucking sleep right now. I'm the only child. Uh, I talk to my camera all the time on Snapchat, but I can't fucking talk to it for five minutes straight without people click, click, click. YouTube, it is what it is. If people stick around and watch it, they do. If they don't, they don't. Um, yeah, it's really just me talking. Um, what's it called? What's it called? So, but point is, I get to see myself now. Mm -hmm. Actually, let's do this real quick. Uh, ooh, so it's me today. In mm, 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 mm. a year from now, my booty will be bigger. I am manifesting a fat ass. Mm, mm. But yeah, see, I just want to get rid of this. I think I have PCOS, honestly, because I get, see that? I get so bloated so easily. And my aunt has it, so that shit could be genetic. <clears throat> but. I am just so excited. <laughs> Bro, you guys wanna see something funny? Huh? I think it's cool, especially because I never really had this. My friend Sierra's like, bitch, you're buff as fuck. And she just makes me feel really buff. <laughs> I don't know, people are probably like, okay. But I think it's kinda cool that I finally have that. Mm. But anyways, yeah, I don't really know why I started recording. I just felt like talking. I didn't really feel like sitting here in silence today. Um. So I'm gonna finish this. I'm waiting for my headphones to charge too. While I'm waiting for that, I'm gonna do some stretching. And then I'll just update you guys when I'm at the park. Usually I would walk to the park, but usually I walk to the park and then walk my way back. So this time I'm just gonna drive to the park and I'm gonna do a whole bunch of laps and then walk because it's a lot of fucking walking. Walking all the way over there, then doing the laps. And I don't know, I, just, I actually feel like walking on grass today instead of cement, I don't know, so. I will update you guys when I'm there. Deuces.